One second, everything is going fine. The next, the pilot has to determine the exact right moment to pull the handle and eject to avoid an untimely death. In this video, we're going through five insane moments where pilots had to eject at the last minute. Back in 2009, a Royal Air Force Harrier plane was taking off out of Kandahar, Afghanistan. You can see there's a problem right away in the video. The plane begins to descend, but it comes in too fast, and the rate of the descent is far too much. This causes the nose of the plane to break off, and things go from bad to worse real quick. The plane continues making its way down the runway with flames spewing out of the underside. In a matter of seconds, the flames completely overtake the cockpit, forcing the pilot to make an emergency ejection. The pilot lands a safe distance away from the wreckage as the plane continues its transformation into a ruthless inferno. Pretty scary if you ask me. This kind of video serves as a good reminder why the Harrier aircraft has earned its nickname, the Widowmaker. Air shows are supposed to be a fun time for the entire family, but this next video shows how terribly wrong they can go. A pilot took a MiG-29 to the Paris Air Show in 1989 to perform high-flying feats of bravery. The pilot made various flips and turns during the show before making his final pass over Le Boucher Airfield in anticipation of a successful landing. The pilot, Anatoly Kvoker, was finishing a turn out of a square loop when things took an unexpected turn. It wasn't long until the aircraft took a steep dive towards the ground, leaving the pilot only seconds to eject. Something suddenly and dramatically went wrong with the right engine. After an investigation, it was determined that the right engine had failed due to a bird flying into it. This caused the left engine to push the airplane to the right. Because he was going so slow, he was unable to correct the turn. He later stated that his first instinct was to save the plane. When he learned that wasn't possible, he directed the aircraft towards the ground and away from spectators. Thanks to quick wits and expert timing, Anatoly survived the crash with minimal injuries. He was soon taken to a nearby military hospital where his condition was reported as more or less satisfactory. Alexander Batkov of the Ministry of Aviation Industry said Anatoly was one of our best pilots, and it's that kind of training that allowed him to avoid an even greater tragedy that day. Life on an aircraft carrier is hard, but it gets a lot harder when you have accidents like this that endanger not only the pilot, but the lives of everybody on board. This next video shows a pilot bringing in an F-A-18 Hornet that was supposed to land on the carrier. Unfortunately, the plane was victim to a broken arrestor cable, causing it to dive into the sea off of the carrier. It's kind of hard to see, so look closely as the pilot ejects right as the plane is about to descend to a watery grave. But the carnage isn't over yet. The broken arrestor cable slingshots back towards the crew on board the ship, traveling fast enough to end a life under the right conditions. It's about to hit a person wearing a yellow shirt who, without looking, jumps over the flying cable not once but twice. Which one of these clips was your favorite? Be sure to let us know in the comments down below. Otherwise, click the link on screen to check out five insane high-speed flyovers. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.